Hi all, this is a quick tutorial in which I will be showing you how I was able to get COD 4X to run on Linux, specifically Linux Mint 20.2, which is based on Ubuntu, which is based on Debian. As a disclaimer, I am not affiliated with COD 4X, but I like playing the mod and I found a good workaround to get the client running on my Linux machine. All you need is to have the game Call of Duty 4 on Steam. Install it. Make sure it launches with whatever version of Proton you're using, and make sure you launch it twice. On the first launch, you'll see Punkbuster and Microsoft DirectX get installed. Punkbuster will fail to update and uh, give you a 404 error, and DirectX may complain as well, but soldier through all those warning messages that you may receive. On the second launch, you'll see Punkbuster open and run, but you can just exit it and then the game will actually open again. Grab the Windows client from the COD 4X site. Extract everything from the install folder and dump it into Steam's COD 4 folder in its install location. It may ask if you want to overwrite some files, mainly a DLL. You can do that. Now comes the fun part. You can't see it, but I put quotes there because it really comes down to making folders and manually doing what the Windows batch script does for those installing this on Windows. The easiest thing you can do for yourself is to run this script on a Windows computer, then just find the folder in your app data, uh, local folder, and then copy it to your Linux machine in the directory we'll go over in a bit. If you don't have access to a Windows machine to do this, you'll have to manually follow what the file structure needs to be. Your app data folder, Call of Duty 4 on Steam references, to use the 4x mod is in the following very long directory. It's at your home folder slash dot steam slash steam slash steam apps slash compat data slash 7940 which is COD4's steam ID slash pfx slash drive c slash users slash steam user slash app data slash local. You'll need to create a folder called Call of Duty 4 MW. And in that folder, you'll need to place three other folders, a bin folder, a main folder, and a zone folder. I believe the players folder you may be seeing right now is created when selecting your, your player profile in the game. So you don't have to make that or worry about that. In the bin folder, create a subfolder called cause 4 x underscore 020 and place the file iw3mp.exe in there. In that subfolder that we just made, place the files you see on the screen right now. Go back to the base Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare folder and go into main. Place this jcodflorex underscore 00.iwd file. Then go back to the base folder again and go into zone. Place these last two files in that folder. Once all is said and done, when you launch COD4's multiplayer, you should see COD4 say it stopped and that it, you need to restart the game. Once you launch it for the hopefully final time, you should now see the mod is working. The easiest way to make sure that you're actually working is to see COD4X's text on the title screen. It should be towards the right. Enjoy playing COD4X on Linux.